Easy. Property, like, like, look at what we're doing. <laughs> some may, some may white, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> wouldn't get, wouldn't pass in my school, no, I wouldn't. I can, I can walk out the classroom without getting a detention. Excuse me, ma'am, I'm gonna go take a pee. Truancy, detention, suspension, expulsion. I have to piss? We all have to piss? What am I getting in trouble for that? Actually, as soon as I finish this mission, I'm finna do a story time for y'all about the time I got suspended in high school. The one time. All right, y'all. So back in high school, I took I took choir. I, that you know, I got vocals. I can I can hit a little dance step here and there. I had to I had to showcase it, and it was also counted as a credit for a, a second language. Like you had to take a language course. So I, I was not good at Spanish. I'm gonna try and learn Spanish, but honestly, Spanish is just not for me. So I uh, I took choir, and it was zero period choir, which means you had to show up. Bro, I'm not playing Arkham, y'all. I'm not playing Arkham, y'all. Yeah, <laughs> Don, I see you in the chat, bro. He said that comment was not for you, dude. <laughs> there I go again. You just handed me another L. Uh, so zero period was 7 a.m. classes. They had like zero period, everything, everything. But you would take a, you could take one class before school started so that you can leave a class before school ended. Yo, Titty Ray, thank you for the thank you for the bits. Uh, so I took zero period choir. Everybody up in there was sleepy. I don't know how they expected us to sing. We're literally rolling out the bed, sprinting to school, and then getting in class to sing and dance. I'm like, all right, whatever. Better than learning Spanish. So I had a lot of friends in that class, and sometimes, you know, we would show up late or like, you know, I would never ditch. Uh, hold on, let me let me switch the screen because I can't really read these. Uh, uh, Mary Kay the man, thank you for the bits. Get you some merch, bro. It's gonna be lit. It's gonna be fire. Goku, thank you for the bits. Dead, thank. What's up with you, bro? Thank you for the resubscription. The five months in a row, dead. Uh, three hundred. Much love to you, bro. Much love. All right, let me fin let me finish my story real quick, and then uh, then then I'll, I'll shut everybody out. So uh, yeah. So every now and then I would show up late, and uh, I remember. <laughs> And this is this is my senior year of high school, so I really thought I was running the canvas, thought I was hot shit, yada yada yada. Um, and so I, th I believe that I took that class with Joe, if I'm not mistaken, but could be wrong. But I oh no no no, this wasn't my senior year. This wasn't my senior year. This was probably my sophomore my sophomore year, because I, I did have the class with Joe and me and him and like two other people. We would show up to class late all the time. But it'd be like late by like two minutes, three minutes. But my teacher, she was a stickler, bro. She did not play that. If you showed up in a class after the bell, the bell could ring. And as you're running into the class, if the bell stopped before you get into the door, I forgot what her first punishment was. I think it might have been like, I don't know, like, like, like standards where you had to write like 50 lines or something like that. I don't know. It was some bull. But because me, Joe, and the other two kids that we was that we hung out with was class clowns. She always felt like it was okay to make examples out of us. Like, she had no problem roasting us because we was joking around in the class. <laughs> it's like, you making people laugh? I'm going to make people laugh at you. It's like, all right, fair game. We didn't care. She was still kind of cool. And so uh, I remember one day she was like, and maybe I had been late like three times by me like barely missing it, right? And she's like, yo, if you come in late one more time. I'm throwing, I'm throwing you into on school suspension. I'm not, I'm not gonna play with you no more. You think, you think I'm a joke? I'm like, no. Uh, I'm gonna call her, I'm gonna call her Miss C for right now. I'm like, no, Miss C. Like, I definitely don't. You're my favorite teacher, dude. Like, we have the most fun in your class. Relax. Like, you're, 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 you're directing choir plays, like musicals, like happy and fun times. Like, <laughs> don't be a downer. This is my young self, though. As an adult, looking back, oh, I, I was probably so fucking annoying. I could, I wouldn't be able to deal with me in my class. Anyways, that day comes. I'm running late for zero period choir. My mom, I think she might have been dropping me off that day. And she's like, yo, you gotta run, bro. You gotta, you, you got you just gotta get out the car and start running. I'm like, mom, if I get out here and that bell rings, I'm gonna get thrown into suspension. She's like, well, you should run. So I get out. It's probably like it's probably like 6:59 and 35 seconds. I get out the car. I'm booking it to the room. 
hitting corners. I'm dodging people that's saying what's up to me. Like, hey, what's up, bro? No, not today, bro. See you later at lunch, bro. I'm like going. Sure enough, I get to the door. I swear, it looked like a movie where I'm like. And sure enough, I do not make it within the time. I'll walk in maybe like five seconds later. She look at me. <laughs> she look at me, bro. And I'm, I'm like, oh, she's not getting mad at me. I must be cool. She go into her office. And that's when we all do a warm-up. When she go into her office, she comes up maybe like three minutes later. She's like, all right, so let's get started. So I'm in the line doing warm-ups. Like, so far, Lita, see that beep, oh. See that beep, God, see that beep, doo doo. I'm just hitting my notes, right? All of a sudden, I see security walk through the door. I'm like, oh, shit, Randall, that's for you, bro. He smell your high ass again, bro. How are you still getting high zero period, bro? Where your brain cells at? Then I just feel like this, uh, Mr. Edmund. Huh? Mr. Edmund, you need to come with me. And at the time, bro, the security guard, I thought he was my homie, bro. There was two security I'm not going to name their names. Because I think they might be in trouble with the law for some sexual misconduct but there was two security guards that i thought was cool with me he pulled me out of the class he like bro uh i'm sorry but you're headed to on school suspension um grab your bags and you'll be headed to the whatever room it was for the rest of the day i'm like sure you know this is zero period right the day hasn't even started yet technically you want me to be up in that room from 7 a.m. till 2.37 p.m., he's like, I mean, rules are rules, you know, and I, I believe you broke, the, you broke the rule first. I'm like, okay, all right. So uh, I get to on-school suspension. I'm in the office, and I see, like, I see, like, six other dudes already in. <laughs> Bro, class isn't even starting yet. What are y'all doing in here? I think I see maybe three people trickle in as the day went on, but like it started with like five of us in there. Maybe they already planned the day before to get there for on school suspension, but whatever, bro. It felt like jail, bro. I'm walking in. I feel like I gotta keep my head up high, scan the room real quick, don't make eye, con eye contact with nobody, but still let everybody know I'm looking. Then I walk to my seat. I'm like, bro, I ain't seen y'all since like PE. Like, <laughs> why all the bad kids be, like, excelling in PE, bro? That's how they, they grow up and they do UFC and co other combat sports, bro. But uh, anyways, I'm sitting in that room, and I'm like, I mean, OCS isn't that bad. So let me just let me just see if I got any homework I can do. Did all my homework already. Let me try and draw something. Ain't, ain't got no inspiration. Ain't got no drawing. I'm not, an art, I'm not an art student. I'm sitting there like. Yo, she really threw me in class because I was running to the I was running to the damn door. Like, I started thinking, I'm like, hold on, this is my mom fault. Like, why is my mom fault? I'm finna get up out of here. So I'm like, oh, excuse me, sir, can I go to the restroom and, and use the bathroom real quick? He's like, yeah, make it quick. I'm like, alright, cool. I go to the bathroom, close the stall behind me, I pull out my phone, I call my mom. I'm like, yo, mom, I need you to come pick me up ASAP. Like like right now they got me an on, on, on campus suspension and they're talking about having me up in here all day you know and my mom my mom didn't my mom don't play bro my mom don't play bro she was a monster maybe 10 years ago right now she's slowing down bro she's slowing down in her anger and her wrath but 10 years ago oh you couldn't tell her shit you couldn't tell her a thing she's like hold up they finna have you an on-campus suspension all day when you could be learning and actually gaining something i didn't pay my tax man let me come up to this i'm like okay <laughs> time to go so i go back to the to the uh ocs like nothing happened i'm sitting there do 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 i find i find all the inspiration in the rule i'm i'm drawing like like masterpieces now bro like and she come in she she so 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 she pulls up to the school she goes straight to the office and i i get a call well the dude gets a call on his radio like hey can you bring mr edmund to the front of the office and so uh i'm like all right so, he, so he, he's like, all right, let, let's go. So uh, he takes me to the front office where the assistant principal and the main principal both have their offices in. I can hear her hollering, walking up to the office door. And you know office doors, bro. Them doors be thick as shit. No windows. I heard her yelling. I opened up the door. It was like a gust of wind, like... <sighs> And how dare you have my son up in here wasting all, all my motherfucking tax dollars and you up in here talking about it. I'm like, I mean, my mom don't cuss, but the just the anger you could tell. And like my principal at the time, 
he was a bald dude. So like, I, I'm pretty sure I heard at least like four bald headed jokes, like, like, like within the course of that rant, bro. And so I'm just sitting there and I'm looking at her like, like I'm looking at him like, I mean, what you gonna say back to it? You know, she kind of frying your shit right now. And he's like, all right, if you want your son out of here, uh, this is gonna result in an actual suspension where he cannot come back on the campus for three to five days, depending on, on the uh, the consequence when we deliberate. She's like, I don't give a, uh, she didn't cuss, but she was like, man, I don't care. I, uh, what did she say something like, like, uh, I, I'll, I'll, she said something like, I'll do y'all job for you and, and, and teach him how, how to like, like teach him whatever he's missing basically. Like she was just, her, her mission that day was to make everybody feel like her son, like just, just quiet the entire office. And everybody felt it. Everybody was like, oh shit. Cause I, I went to a, I went to a predominantly white high school, white and Asian. And there was some Mexicans probably in the higher ranks, but like black people, we probably all could fit in a, in two classrooms. Anyway, so they were not used to, to a woman like that. So I'm like, oh shit, my mom really just did. Oh shit, Reliable Savage? Reliable, did you really just? Bro. Reliable. Reliable Savage. Thank you, bro. A hundred dollars on my dome. Whoa, bro. Thank you for supporting the stream, bro. Thank you for supporting me, bro. Bro, anybody who donated who donated that much money, bro, I need y'all to tweet me or email me with proof. I'm gonna hook y'all up with something special, bro. You don't you you didn't have to do it, but Oh, I'm out of key, but I'm glad you, sorry, bro, sorry, bro. Yo, thank you for that donation, though, bro. Okay, so, uh, yo, hey, Michaela, I'm not finna, Michaela, don't tweet, don't comment, talk about throw it back, bro. You're not my bro if you're asking me to, do you ask your real bro to throw it back? So anyways, my principal at the time is like, all right, well, um, if you're choosing suspension, then I guess there's nothing left to do. You can go to your locker and get the rest of your belongings. Oh, no, 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 no. I got the story wrong. I got the story wrong. They didn't tell me I was getting suspended. They were actually going to let my mom take me out of class. They were going to be like, well, we can't hold him like hostage or anything like that. So uh, if you want to take your son out of here, then by all means, you can do that. And she was like, good, you know, we out of here. Like, blah, 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 blah. So then he's like, okay, you can go to your locker now and go get your belongings. So I'm like, all right, cool, I'm up out of here. Go to my locker, and as I'm sitting there putting all my stuff in my bag, the same principal is following me to my locker, and he comes up behind me, and he's like, yo, Berlin, um, I know you're about to head home and everything, but uh, I was just curious, you know, how did your mom know you were in OCS? I'm like, oh, because I went to the bathroom and called. Nigga, I felt my... I felt my stomach drop to my ankles, bro. I was like, did I really just say that? Because in my school, I don't know how it is for y'all now because cell phones are everywhere, but back in the day, if you even pulled out your cell phone, you was liable to be suspended. Like any anytime you contacting, you was liable to be suspended. That was when cell phones was just coming out, bro. So I'm like, did I really just say that? And he's like, so you used your cell phone on campus. You know that's uh, punishable by suspension, right? I'm like yeah he's like all right well come with me we're gonna go tell your mother what's what's going on and i know in that moment he felt like he had won i know he was like got this little stupid you know and in his mind so we go back to the office and, and then he explains to my mom what had happened and that's when my mom was like well good you know i'm gonna teach him how to, i'm gonna teach him what y'all can anyway y'all wasting it y'all wasting both of our time we get in the car my mom still turned up but she was like I don't know. Well, it's crazy thing about black moms, bro. If you do something wrong, and she go and crying, I got, I got a few uh, crazy mom stories, bro. I might have to do a story time about it with her. Oh, that would be excellent content, bro. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna talk about these stories again for the channel. I might post this as a clip or something, but I'm gonna do an actual story time with my mom and talk about these stories. But it's so funny about black moms, bro. If you do something wrong, 
If she go there, it's 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 shoot first, ask questions later, and then if that person that you wronged disrespect your mom, y'all are now on the same team. The punishment out the window. When I went home, I was I was just on Halo Two, Halo Three online all week, bro. She didn't teach me shit, but she got me up at it.